As the U.S. Senate prepares to approve a TikTok ban, the Federal Bureau of Investigation FBI, chief on April 23 underlined security concerns about the popular Chinese own app. FBI Director Christopher Wray said that TikTok parent company ByteDance is beholden to the Chinese government, which is attempting to steal our artificial intelligence and hack American technology every day. Americans must think of TikTok's power, access, capability, control as being in the hands of the Chinese government and intelligence service, Mr. Ray said in an interview with NBC News. Mr. Ray echoed concerns that TikTok poses a threat to U.S. national security. TikTok has adamantly denied sharing any user information with the Chinese government. The U.S. Senate could vote on April 23 on a major aid package for Ukraine, in legislation that also sets the stage to ban video snippet sharing app TikTok. Its passage is all but certain after the U.S. House of Representatives, following months of wrangling, approved the much-awaited bill with broad bipartisan support. Top Senate Democrat Chuck Schumer, whose party narrowly controls the chamber, said that an agreement had been locked in for a vote on April 23. The final package contains a measure to ban TikTok if it doesn't soon cut ties with its Chinese parent company ByteDance. The popular app has come under scrutiny from lawmakers accusing it of being under Chinese government influence, while supporters have decried a ban as a free speech infringement. The bill would give ByteDance as long as a year to sell TikTok or be banned in the US, according to wet bush analyst Dan Ives. Likely bias for TikTok would be Microsoft or Oracle. The analyst said in a note to investors. The broader worry is retaliation from China could come from this forced sale slash ban of TikTok and add more pressure for regulatory and geopolitical headwinds US companies face. Mr. Ives added. Meta is expected to be the biggest beneficiary of a TikTok ban with fans of the app resorting to using Facebook or Instagram.